From inside the Spectrum Center, where the Boston Celtics just beat the Hornets 122-106, to I'm Josue Pavone. The Celtics wiped away a 16-point deficit in the third quarter. However, the scariest moment of the night was easily in the first quarter. Derek White, after going a perfect 3-for-3, three three, including two three-pointers, he ran into Marcus Smart and sprained his neck. It was really slow to get up. Um, really scary moment. It got extremely quiet in this arena. Uh, eventually, White was on his feet. He was helped off the floor, got the standard ovation, and the Celtics put together one heck of a win in his honor. Jason Tatum joking around with us, saying that he got the technical foul uh, for Derek White, even though White ran into Marcus Smart. However, uh, the Celtics did really want to put together a win for Derek. Uh, Derek was was looking good before the game started, man. He was putting up shots. He was knocking down three-pointers. It sort of felt like he was going to have that type of game. And uh, unfortunately, it was cut short. I'm sure we'll get an update before Monday when these two teams go back at it. Martin Luther King, Matt and Nay, we will keep you posted. I'm Josue Pavone, giving you all the latest Celtics news here in Charlotte. Uh, and this report is brought to you by HelloFresh. Head over to HelloFresh.com slash Garden21, where you can sign up for 21 free meals. Anything you're into protein, whether it's vegetarian, whether you want to go seafood, they got everything for everyone. And uh, trust me, it's worth it. Delicious food. You can make this under an hour and the recipe is really easy. You get all the ingredients and you get it shipped right to your door. That's HelloFresh.com slash Garden 21. This report is also brought to you by Athletic Greens. Take care of your health. Head over to AthleticGreens.com slash Garden where you can find out more. I'm Josue Pavone. That is going to do it for me. Stay tuned for my recap for this one. Again, the Celtics beating the Hornets 122 to 106. And I got plenty more here from the Spectrum Center. Stay tuned.